Cosmos. A personal voyage became a smash hit. Astronomy and space exploration are interesting and exciting topics. Yet throughout recent history, scientists have yet to be compelled or encouraged to share their discoveries, or pointedly their failures, with the public. It was enough to publish their results in books or academic journals, or to present their findings at scientific conferences. Many even appeared arrogant about their work. The public wouldn't understand, so why tell them? Even in the 1960s and 1970s, when the media coverage of the Apollo missions heightened the huge public interest and international appeal of space exploration, it remained challenging for average folks to keep up with the latest observations and discoveries. In the United States, the three main broadcast TV networks aired mostly entertainment and news shows, and a fourth, the Public Broadcasting Service, PBS, aired a few good general interest science shows, but nothing focusing on space. In 1980, a charismatic and thought-provoking American astronomer named Carl Sagan hosted a new television series focusing specifically on astronomy and space exploration, Cosmos. A personal voyage became a smash hit. With an audience of more than 500 million people, it was the world's most watched PBS series.